All right, the first thing I wanna change is let's make this center aligned so this looks just a bit better. And then definitely we need to fix this. So I think we definitely need to give these uh, tiles a high, bigger height. Currently there's just not enough space. And maybe we can move this image to the top and display the text below. Because I think if we increase the height even more, it's gonna stretch this image too far and there's not much to see anymore and it's just gonna look off. So in order to increase the height, I'm gonna select this class block preview link block and this is wrapping all this content on here. Let's go about and give it a height of maybe 500 pixels. And then as you can see, this stretches this image way too long and this looks off. So let's move this image up. And in order to move it up, I'm gonna give it a width of 100%. And I'm gonna change its height to 150 pixels. And we need to make sure that this has wrap enabled. And now if I have wrap, this is again, this whole container wrapping everything. And if I choose flex, wrap, this is going to move this image to the top. Now let's make sure that this actually has text element also has a width of 100%. And let's see, do we have some spacing issues here? Maybe we can give it a fixed height of 350 pixels and 500 minus 150 pixels is 350 pixels and the 500 pixels we applied to this whole element wrapping everything. So now we still have some issues here and we need to reduce the padding. Let's set the padding to 10 pixels on both sides. That gives us more space here. And I think we have enough space to display even a bit more text and it looks a lot better already. Now let's inspect the last page. Again, we can scroll to the right. So we need to find the culprit. And I think I found it down here. Let's make sure that this form is going over several lines. And I can tell you exactly why we have this issue because we set these width to 200 pixels and 200 plus 200 is already 400 pixels, but the screen width is only 320 pixels. So let's go about fixing that. And in order to fix this, form, let's make sure that we select this get guide form element, which is wrapping everything and make sure that we enable wrap and that pushes everything into the center. Now we can increase the width of these elements to let's say 300 pixels and give them some margin at the bottom. And let's see that we remove this padding here. There we go. Now that's all we need to do in order to fix this. As you can see, Flexbox, again, is super easy to fix on a mobile screen. And uh, I think we, we should reduce this spacing a bit. So I'm gonna set this padding to 60 pixels. And otherwise, I am happy with this page. Again, we can't scroll to the right anymore. Now the last page I wanna inspect is our blog post itself. And we can't scroll anywhere to the right, but scrolling down works. I think this looks all pretty decent. 
I'm happy with this page. All right, let's publish everything again and then inspect it inside the Chrome browser. And if you have a mobile phone, I highly recommend you to inspect it as well on your mobile phone and play around a bit with your website. And I bet you will find some more things to fix. But otherwise, I think we did a pretty decent job already making it mobile responsive. And there might be one or two small issues which we can always fix later.